anything you want to say? We Thank still want. Hey, Couture Bays, it's your girl, Rupert, going live with the Brie Talking Bay Squad. We got to talk about y'all faves. But before we get started, let's like, comment, and subscribe. Tap that notification bell so you can get all the updates and alerts. And remember, opinions are not facts. Everything we say here is allegedly and for entertainment purposes solely. So sit back, relax, sip you some apple juice or my favorite vegan water, and let's get into the mess, shall we? I can feel people distancing themselves from me for my stance professionally and personally and um i'm re i'm being very emotionally indulgent right now just because i i live by myself so these are the feelings i have and there's no one here to share it with except for <laughs> so y'all are hearing it but i already got blacklisted this year um from certain venues because I stood up for myself professionally when I was being uh, what's the word <laughs> scammed I genuinely am unsure what like is coming next um i think a lot of us feel that way and it that and then you feel that way and then you're like nope you're not being bombed how dare you um But, uh, yeah, you know, you're just like, am I going to have agents? <laughs> like, and, like, what's the other side of this look like? It's very disconcerting. Very, very concerning. Ethically, morally, economically, you know. We have an election. I mean, it's just, it's, it's almost, it's just, it's just a lot to process. A lot to process, you know. Um, I hope, I guess if I'm, I just hope y'all support my work. <laughs> Child Bay Squad, this has to be the saddest thing I've seen to date. To date, and I told y'all Scorpio season was messy. She did a post and delete. Mama is literally out here begging y'all to support her because she don't know where her next meal is going to come from. That's how I read it. And at the end of the day, here's... Here's a little bit of advice for the Amanda Seals of the world. Y'all have to learn when to hush, silence yourself, silence that mouth. Everything doesn't deserve a response, a critique, a praise publicly, especially when you work in industries where several of those people can be offended. Like, girl, learn to play the game or make a way for yourself. And the problem is in all of her life, in the industry, she has not made a way for herself. And her destructive friends like Charlemagne the Goddess can't even get her booked and busy. Child, let this be a lesson, okay? Moving right along, let's get into Jada Pinkett Smith. In the, uh, the No Soccer Mom chapter, right? You shoot down every rumor there's ever been about y'all. That y'all are swingers, that y'all yeah. were both gay and playing each other's biz, that y'all were sleeping with whomever you choose. Yeah. How does it feel in 2023 to still have those same rumors out about people you love, like Will and Dwayne? I know. That just came out too recently. Yeah, you know, and let me just say this. It's ridiculous, right? Um, and it's nonsense. And this is a person that tried a, a shakedown, a money shakedown that didn't work. We're going to take legal action. Um, because it's one thing to have your opinion about somebody versus just making up salacious, malicious stories. Mm -hmm. So that's actionable. So we're going to roll with that. Um, but yeah, I, you know. You say, leave it alone. <laughs> Don't go no further. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh, no, no. Oh, Nobody oh, said anything. Oh. It's, um, you know, so for me, unfortunately, it's part of it. You know what I mean? It's not true. 
we gonna take care of it, and that's that. How does so there was, there was a money shakedown prior. Oh yeah, there was a money. Oh, he tried to extort you before. Or? Well, it's it's based around this person's idea that they, in some way, were doing business around Will's book. And that they spent money or what have you, and that they needed to be compensated. So he already tried to do this money shakedown. Mm-hmm. Um, Will was willing to give him a certain amount or what have you, and he didn't take it. So this whole situation is based on that. Mm-hmm. Give him a certain amount. Why though? Just well, be, be, because of some business that they had. And I don't mm-hmm. know the complete details about mm-hmm. it, but that's about to come out because, like I told you, about to take legal action. All right. Mm-hmm. You should. Yeah, no, we are mm-hmm. for sure. I was asking how's Will dealing with it? You know, with oh, does he laugh it off? Release a statement. His Will. Here's the one good thing about Will. Will's always gonna find the funny. I figured that. Yeah, he's always gonna find the funny. You know what I'm saying? And so they all laughed at the, the the murder, murder, kill, kill. We yeah. 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 <laughs> you you have to you have to because it's absolutely ridiculous you know what i'm saying and so all you have is is you just gotta laugh about it you know and it's unfortunate because did he ask you like do i look like i give off bottom <laughs> 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 he was like do you believe this shit you know but we just laughed about- oh child so everybody sees what's going on and this has nothing to do with tosh k tosh k was not the first to interview this man but i will be tuning in tonight because i know he's going to be spilling all the tea especially since tasha k is going to have it on the app at the end of the day the former assistant is wrong y'all the former assistant is wrong especially if he was out for some type of money grab baby you are going to jail prison they are going to ruin you but let's get into kiki that you put her through? That you put her through? What the fuck is you saying, Igor? That you put her through? Can you speak English? That's part of the reason why you can't get no acting job. I'm sure. Your articulation is poor. I'm sure. What the fuck are you saying? I'm sure. I'm on Wiggins. I, 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 if, 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 if only, if only, if only you actually like. Can you put it through? What does that mean? Can you put it through? <laughs> he's trying to say. He's trying to do the whole <clears throat> child actor. <clears throat> parents um, sacrifice their childhood gag. Oh, well, okay, well, we got um, look at her. $30 million dollars today. Look at so, her. That's fine. Yeah, I sacrificed her, I guess. Okay. Come on, Wiggins. But what did your mom do to you? Huh? She fucked you up. My mom's fine. You should have been a child entertainer. I'm good. If you should have been one, maybe you would have more gumption. Maybe you would have more get to do it. Because your mama fucked you up. She turned you into a punk-ass mama's boy who harasses a woman. What kind of bullshit is that? Your mama should be ashamed of herself. She should be telling you, why are you harassing this girl, Jerry? Why are you doing this? Why well, say horrible things to her? She's the one that kept wanting to come back around. Trust me, I didn't want this. But well, that makes no sense as to why you harass. You know, there's no need to say horrible things and send me this usher picture. There's no reason for that. You do that because you're nuts. There's no reason for you to say that. Jezebel, calling me Haiti. That's all necessary. You do all of that unnecessarily because something's wrong with your mind. It's not normal. You sound like you have a broken brain and you need to go to see somebody because you're chemically imbalanced. There's nothing that I've done for you to stay on that page. People have endured more. I've endured more from you and I don't do that to you. I don't sit up there and call y'all kinds of names and do stuff like that. You randomly have, have an episode and then you harass me for an hour straight. Her mom That's what you do. It's not normal. It's not necessary. You could just not talk to me. I'm gonna harass you. Up is bisexual. He sleeps with men, you stupid motherfucker. I'm on Wiggins. You should know you spend a lot of time with Julian. You was a dumb motherfucker. And then you let your family, you let your brother talk you into, oh, hey man, look, your brother's a pussy too. His reputation in Hollywood is he's a fuck boy. And he's an asshole. And nobody really likes him. Lord London don't like his ass. Armand Wiggins. So at the end of the day, you, the Jacksons, are fucking jokes. You guys are fucking jokes. That's what you are. You're a fucking joke. So don't blame Kiki for being a joke. You was a joke before you met her. Armand Wiggins. So don't blame her. Don't call her cunt. And what man thinks they gonna call the mother of their child cunt, bitches, whore, you been run through, but I'm gonna come and get the baby. What kind of mental motherfucker are you? 
Nobody does that, that Darren. You think? Nobody does that. What, what, so. woman, what woman wants their child to go be with a man who calls them cunt and bitches? That's the stupidest thing I've ever my daughter ever, ever give you the baby after you call her a cunt. I'm going to be her ass. I'm mom oh, yeah. and you know what Baby's gonna be back in my arms. I'm like, uh, the inevitable's gonna happen. He's gonna grow up to be a man, a real man, no, and no, he's gonna go ahead and just not come, not come on over. All right. Dad, I'm his dad. I'm his dad. I'm his dad. I don't care about what you all think. I don't care what you think, especially PP. I don't care about what anybody else thinks. Sharon, your opinion is very little to me. You're you're, you're wasting your breath right now, Sharon. You're you're you're, you're wasting your breath right now. You're wasting your breath right now. Trust me. Yeah. Nigga, nigga, Armand Williams. Bro, I've seen this like 20 different times, Sharon. It doesn't phase me anymore. <laughs> None of what y'all do phase me anymore. Come on now. Where's my son at? Where's my son at? Armand Williams. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. You are a dickless motherfucker. I'm sure. I don't know what the fuck my daughter just saw in your lip dick ass. That, that, I'm about to fix it. I'm about to fix it. <laughs> that's what you raised. That's what you raised. You are, yeah, and that's what your mama raised. Dick suckers. Okay. Your brother's a dick sucker too. I'm sure. Both of y'all are dick suckers. I'm sure. You probably suck dicks too. Okay. I'm on Wiggins. Yep. All right, so about a bullet. All right, so about that bullet again. Keep fucking with me, you might get a dick in your ass. Okay. Keep fucking with me. Okay. You motherfuckers don't know who you dealing with. Ah, uh, y'all, y'all have no idea who you stepped up and to play with. But it's all good. I tried to be nice to you. Yeah. I tried to be nice because I thought you had some mental problems. Nope. So I tried to be nice, but you gonna talk about my daughter? You gonna harass my daughter? You gonna talk about Usher? Usher is gay. Armand Williams. Even your stupid ass family don't even understand the business. Usher is gay, guys. Armand Told her to put some clothes on. Told her to put some clothes on. Told her to put some clothes on. You are stupid. Told her to put some clothes on. You are a stupid man. She's a mom. She has to put some clothes on. She's a mom. She has to put some clothes on. family are crazy, chaotic, harassing people. They are harassing my family. They are harassing my daughter. Where's my son at? Even Marcus, jo even Marcus Johnson, the nigga that your brother's named after, his kids told me y'all are crazy. Okay. He was the one in the in the video. They told me that you and your brother's crazy. It's crazy because your brother's named after after their dad. Right. And they said y'all are nuts. I'm sure. I'm sure. Can he still hear me? Oh yeah, he is. I'm just waiting for my son. Where's my son at? It's football Sunday. He used to be with his family. Armand with him. Fuck you, nigga. You ain't got a family. They have, they, they have nothing to do with this. They have nothing to do with this. They have nothing to do with this. No, they don't. Come on, Wiggins. Okay. My son. Why harass me? You don't my have son. to harass me. But for my son. But you don't have to harass me. My son. Where's my son? Where's my son? Where's my son? That's all I'm just asking for. I'm not here for her. Child, Armand is mad that DJ Academics put all this information out there first and proved that he's not a hundred percent a heat man, woman hater, like 
Gumby. At the end of the day, this does nothing for Darius but make him look like the fool. We stand with Miss Sharon. She's supposed to protect her child. And she even issued out an apology to Usher. And baby, we definitely understand because when your baby is in love with danger, you got to do everything to combat that demon. But those are just my thoughts, Space Squad. Those are my opinions. Of course, we're going live tonight. Comment down below. I got to go. Bye, hoes.